In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to remove the background of an image using Adobe Photoshop. So to get started today, you will need to open up the image that you would like to work with. As you can see, I'm using this photo of a girl. And what I want to do is I want to cut around her and keep the image of the girl, but remove everything behind her and make it all transparent. So anything in the background there that's been blurred out, I would like to make transparent. Okay, so to get started on this, you'll need to head over to your Layers panel on the right-hand side of the page. If you can't see your layers, simply press F7 or go to your window menu and select layers. Now with this layer selected, you need to right click on it and go to convert to smart object. And then right click on that layer again and choose rasterize layer. You're now ready to start cutting out the background. You'll need to go to your properties panel next. If you can't see this properties panel, you need to go to window and just select properties. Once the properties panel is up, simply scroll down to the quick action section and choose remove background. Photoshop will think about that for a couple of seconds and then bam, that's done. Okay, so very quickly, Photoshop has cut around your model, deleted everything in the background, you're left with that transparent background. So that's exactly what I'm after. If you wanted to refine the edge, if there's a few areas that you're not happy with how Photoshop's cut it out, you can go up to the select menu and choose select and mask. And you've got a few tools down the left hand side here as well as some properties on the right that you can play around with to try and smooth off the edges a little bit more. But I think Photoshop's done a really good job with my cut so I'm just going to cancel that and leave it as is. Now to save this with the transparent background you'll need to go to File and Export and choose Quick Export as PNG. Now you need to save as a PNG file if you want that background to remain transparent. If you try and save it as a JPEG file that background will turn white. Okay, so make sure you're saving as a PNG file. Okay, so let's call that girl transparent and click save. And it's as easy as that. Now just to show you one more trick, if you want to replace the background with something else, so we've scrapped that previous background and we want to replace it with something new, all you need to do is find the image that you would like to replace your background with and save it to your computer. And I'm going to go to file and place embedded. So I've got this picture of this city that I would like to put in the background. It will need a bit of a resize, so just hold Shift and Alt to resize it. Press the tick when you're done. And basically, we need to switch these layers around and we're done. The city at the moment is on top of the girl. That's why we can't see her. So if I just drag that city layer beneath the girl, it'll go in the background. The girl comes out on top and we've now got our new background. You could play around with some adjustments here of the girl to try and match up the colours of the model and the background, but again, that's something that you can do in your own time. I don't want to waste any more time now in this video, but that is how you make a transparent background in Adobe Photoshop behind your model, and I've also shown you how to replace the background with another image. Okay, happy editing!